Works Racing Round 7 guys brought to you by Rocky Mountain ATV MC and we got side by sides gonna rip it up out here in Vernal, Utah. I'm pretty excited and I haven't seen them since the, the Andersons put on that little head to head event down there and Riverside is pretty fun to see so cool to see some of those guys get back up here and uh, do a little longer race and have some fun this weekend. <laughs> We're at round seven in Vernal. This is a new track for us. We've never been here before, so pretty excited about it. It's always fun to come to a new venue. get kind of dry so I think a whole shot's going to be pretty important and uh, with the Can-Am power that we have um, producing right now I think we got a pretty good shot at that so it's going to be just get out front quick and um, try to set a good pace and um, save the car the rest of the race. I think it, if it gets uh, pretty loose it will probably get rough and um, then it will become um, managing the car and um, see, you know, I feel like I got a pretty good chance at that. I did judge, I raced for Factory Can-Am. Uh, I raced my Can-Am X3. Um, this season so so far for me has been uh, decent. It's kind of been most of uh, kind of a learning year. So uh, yeah, we've had, I've had a lot of um, overheating issues in my last car that have kind of held me back from a lot of points this year. But um, that's all that's behind me now. We got two fresh cars showing up to Vernal here. And uh, yeah, just got, just got back from practice and uh, the car's feeling really good, feeling really comfortable, and I can't wait to race. Well, same thing like Bo, it's a start. Uh, got the whole shot, and once you get down in that canyon, it's, <laughs> it's sad, but they can't see, so the, that's pretty much what, what gets it, though. And from there, just try to chase them down on time, but obviously it didn't work. Got to a good start keeping the car together, all that stuff. Yeah, the track, uh, you know, during practice, I was a little nervous because all the rocks and stuff, but actually the track wasn't that bad at all. It wasn't rough. Um, I made a shock change going from my short core shocks to an off-road shock, which is better. And, uh, man, it worked great. Awesome, man. Good job. Anybody you want to thank? Yeah, I want to thank uh, Amplex Racing, Polaris, uh, GBC Tires, man. <laughs> those things stuck together good. Tire blocks, no flats. Um, Method wheels. Uh, she never else that helps me out. I appreciate it. My wife, or she couldn't be here this weekend, so that part sucks.
you know, just just hang in there. Just hang in there the best I can and, and go from there. Yeah, we on it. Yeah, we on it. Yeah. We 